Well, I'm back to my Victoria 2 Bakara playthrough as it's 1874 as I invade the Commonwealth as they're just falling apart. I'm helping out I, um, Turkey and also I'm getting ready to devilishly attack Crimea. <laughs> oh boy, I'm going to get a bigger chunk of territory at, at on the Commonwealth's expense and I don't even have to really fight for it. I'm, yeah, I'm fighting them literally, but that's only, but, um, Crimea broke away from them. I'm just helping out Iraq, I mean, I'm Turkey, so I can help weaken the Commonwealth even more. Oh my god, can you imagine the great, um, the great retraction, or uh, contraction that we're looking at right now with the Commonwealth? They've fallen apart so badly in this game, it's sad, almost. And look at that, they're giving up. Hmm, let me see something. That was... Okay, so that's 5 infamy. That's less than 5 infamy. If I add on a state at 16, 21... Okay, I should be able to afford this. But then again, I won't, if I do this, I'm not going to be able to take care of... Get rid of that stupid message. Fuck it, you know what? I'm going to decline it because I want to take over more. Let's see. Let's add on maybe Kiev. That's going to be pretty ugly border, but hey, it will really hurt. And honestly, maybe I'll start releasing countries too, because I have that option. And I've already took over a good chunk of Kiev, so maybe it'll give up very soon, especially since I'm about to go into Warsaw. Yeah, because then if I take over like Crimea and Ukraine, we have to take over this part of Crimea that didn't break away. I need to take over this. Then I would have to probably take over that. It's going to look so ugly if I don't take all this shit over. Let's see. Will they surrender now, maybe? Alright, so you're going to be stubborn, Turk. Um, you're going to be stubborn, Commonwealth, I see. Okay, then, well, enjoy your death. Slow, painful death. I'm more than happy to oblige you. Alright, now I took your capital over. Will you surrender now? You bastards. I right, keep invading. Down here, yep, I'm just winning. Keep winning, keep winning with no effort. I'm like, oh, okay, they're throwing everything they got in that battle. Okay, that's gonna be a problem. Looks like they're gonna win. Oh my god, I gotta wait one more four more days. Retreat. Okay, so we suffered a loss, sadly. They just threw everything they got to try and win that one. They were determined to get that back. So I guess I'm not fully able to take on Commonwealth completely yet. My arm, because my army attack is still pretty bad. Sucks I can't make them retreat outwards. I'm going to stop expand out right here. Hopefully it'll just surrender soon. gonna be a stubborn one I see and that doesn't make me happy oh my god they attacked me I might as well attack Crimea now get their asses out of the way since they're doomed keep going in let's make this as quick as possible as now got that. Now let's go for iron muzzled loaded rifle I mean, artillery. Oh great, I lost a whole entire stack now. Lovely. 
My only failure so far with this war. It looks like we're not they're not gonna be able to win that as we're just killing um we're just killing Crimea. Oh great, looks like they banned me. Ugh, we're barely holding on right there, it's not good. God, that message is driving me so insane. Alright, we moved Gujarati from Gujarat from Ming Sphere. So yay, but that's no not the point though. Oh my god, Commonwealth, you've lost already. Just give up. You're not winning this shit. And up here. Coal production going up. Hell yeah. I got Mick Crimea had a really big army for being a primitive that just broke away. But, they're dead. They're definitely not winning. Alright, go down here. Sucks are going to take the capital back. That's a big L. You head back up north for right now. You're, you've taken too much damage. Great. Warsaw fell. God, the war has not gained any sort of war score whatsoever. Like, what on earth is going on? <clears throat> it's hard to believe we're going to probably beat Crimea before we beat um, the Commonwealth out. That's insane. Well, there we go. As we're about to beat them. Oh, there we go. So, cr wow. So, we beat Crimea before we beat the Commonwealth. That is insane. Well, then. Alright. Let's get back to killing the Commonwealth now. I mean, God, how much more invading do they need before they just surrender? 17 score. I mean, oh my god, their war exhaustion is high, but they still stubbornly and defiantly refuse. Head back up here. Oh, now what? Dynam, now what? No, no, no. Let Ming kill you. I'm not helping you at all. <laughs> Come back later when I maybe take care of Ming, but right now I'm taking care of Europe. That's not good, but at least we're having more troops coming in. Yeah, boy! That'll help out a lot. Not gonna help out that one battle, but hey, that'll help out to get a nice boost. All right, all of Crimea literally is now under my control. Man, we're still fight. Oh, now they'll finally surrender. Yeah, God. I did. Oh my God, that border gore is ugly. But hey, we beat Crimea's. I mean, well, well, technically, yeah, we did beat Crimea's ass, but we beat. Um, the Commonwealth's ass again. It's just not been their game so far. Open up. Alright, make you into a colony. And then build... Fuck it, let's build a luxury factory. 
All right, another victory won. All right, now pause as... Oh my god, so many troops I gotta work with. And of course, this bullshit. One, two, three, four, five. And here we go again. Don't have any artillery. So now I'm not gonna be able to do any more troops until I get a new stack of artillery built. Hey, at least I won. I'm gonna cut tariffs down to... I think I had it down to 45% last time. Here we go. 45%. Alrighty now, as all. Oh, oh, oh my god! Commonwealth! Can you not have rebels for once in your life? God! As soon as I kill you, you have rebel problems again! Oh my goodness! As my industry's doubled in these last like six years! I hate you, Mongol. God, I hate with that message. It triggers me so much. Maybe if I get him in your sphere, I'll probably... Oh, fuck. Well, fucking... Ming banning me. I'm gonna have to work on my spheres off-screen. But now, that was a big war win. Getting Crimea and a good chunk of Ukraine. I gotta keep taking over Ukraine to get rid of this ugly border gore. That's just the Commonwealth is just dying. Their industry's going up, so good for them. Who's the ally with them? Oh, Holland. Holland's a nobody. They're not going to be able to defend you. Alright, so now... Let's work on the output, because we need to work on that really badly. It was in bad shape. Alright, we're gonna have to wait till next April to get that. That'll help my steel factories a lot. Alright, build more ships. I've, let's see, I've neutered Timurid somewhat. Delhi I've beaten, but not really done anything to them. The Commonwealth I just killed. And Ming, I haven't beaten them yet, but I have to eventually start expanding that, especially to get this ugly crap. Wait, that reminds me too! Let's see, because I have a, event, a special event that gives me cores. Yeah, here it is, but I can't do it yet. I gotta get mass politics. That's not until 1900 at the earliest. So I got several decades to go before I could do that, but that's where I get a whole bunch of cores out here to, like, make, like, a Russian border. Are you kidding me? Oh my god, are you kidding me? Seriously? There were troops in Australia that I didn't know about? Oh my god. Now it's gonna take years and years and years and years and years. Are you shitting me? I can't believe that. Are you kidding me? Unbelievable. Is my industry in fact going up? Yep. Dynam will help ally you again, but next time, don't do stupid shit like that again. You're not gonna win. Just sit back and just wait until it's time. As more naval bases have been built up. I need to work on them eventually, and here we are, 1875 now. What a big decade it's been so far in the 1870s as we continue to expand. So, see you guys next time.